Hello good people, this time I want to share about how to trap a moles in your garden and guarantee we can catch them and kill them. For your information guys, the moles love after rain because easier for them to dig. Moles loves the grubs, earthworms, snails, spider and other insects. Look what the mole done to my garden and my yard. So annoying. They all over my yard. This is the view from the back of our garden. And this is kind of tunnels they made. Here the damage the moss make. They make all those holes around that to here and to our garden bed. Look, they bother my garden bed, rest garden bed, right there too. You see here from here. There, from here, and there too. Oh my! And here in front of my garden, see like this. And there too, underneath the tomato plants, and in the walls. Park is always here. Always come up here. Make the roots die. Or right here too. See out there is the new mound. They're digging up. Over right there too. Through there too. Look like all over at first i just sad and don't know what to do when the moles destroy the roots of my plants all over my garden but when we went to the hardware store my husband find the trap for the moles we chose the trap because we're gonna put in in our vegetable garden that way we use no poison that will be danger for us Now here I will show you how to setting the trap and some tricks it's easier to setting the trap. It will guarantee works and kill the bull. So the first step is identify which is the active tunnels. When you set the trap, don't worry about big mound like this because if we setting it flat and if the next day they're not dig up the same place again so that is not active tunnels to know which one is the tunnel is currently active to pressing your foot down on the tunnel and spacing it flat and if they dig the tunnel again we can see that the best place to set your trap we found this is the busiest tunnels After I make it flat like this, and then see, there is a tunnel. It's easier to poke around with a stick, and then easier for you to put the marks here. And then the next day, we check again if they did, if they dig up again. So this is, we're gonna set the trap. I'm wearing gloves, just make sure to keep it safe. So this is the problem that I found, or probably some people do too. So some people find out a problem to set up the trap. So make sure this arm is 
the side of this a plate So now time to set the traps. This is the tunnels. Make sure this sprung towards to the tunnels. And press it up and down. Make sure there is no big roots or anything underneath it. And we catch the bottom of the tunnels. The trap is set now, and what you do is just wait. Hopefully, a couple of hours, but at least 24 hours of a couple of days, you come back and check them out. So, this is luck. So here, guys, after a couple of days, two days, right? Yeah. Uh, we put a trap for the moles, and then finally today. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. and how I setting the trap for the moles in our yard to your yard and hopefully works in your yard too and let me know if you catch any more appreciate it guys thanks for watching see you soon